Hi everyone, so today I am going to show you how to clean your recycle bin in Windows 10. So the first method is just click on your recycle bin uh, here and right click it. Then click empty recycle bin. So what I have in my recycle bin are these files and so if I click uh, empty recycle bin right now it will clean all of the files but I'm not going to do that if I do that I won't be able to show you the second method so let's go to the second method go to your file explorer and then go to this PC now in here if you have multiple drives click one of the drives like this and right click and then go to properties then you have to go to this cleanup and then you have to just select recycle bin in here it is um there is a lot of things that are checked but you have to uncheck them like this so after you have unchecked all of them then click ok then it will start cleaning but remember if you have deleted something from this drive only it will remove those files but if you have removed something from this file which has gone to recycle bin that won't be deleted for an example if you have removed something from json e and if i go to properties and then this cleanup and then clean it then it will be removed but if i go to juicy and use the disk cleanup there but i have deleted the files in json e it wouldn't really matter because uh, it would just clean just D, not just an E. Okay, so that's how this thing works. So, um, by this method, you can be beneficial in your case, I guess, but I'm not because I'm just going to delete everything I want to. So, I'm just going to do this the first method right click the uh, recycle bin and click empty. Now, I'm going to click yes. Okay, so you can see the recycle bin, you know, the icon has changed to, you know, empty and let's look into it. So you can see there is nothing. That means all of the files from all the drives that were here has been uh, deleted. So again, if you didn't understand what uh, the uh, what the second method was, it was in simple terms if you have deleted something from C and if you clean from C it will just remove C file if you uh, go to D and clean there it wouldn't really uh, clean the C right so the analogy is like that then I guess you have done it and this is really a simple method so if you learn if you have learned it great and I will see you in the next video thank you